Hey everyone, I hope you're all doing well. Hello, hello everybody, welcome, welcome, welcome. Wednesday, how's it going? Welcome to your stream, thank you Mel. How's things, how's everybody doing? I know a lot of people here already. Faye, how you doing? Mel, Butterbear's lurking I think. Good to see you, thanks for being here. Zoe, did you get first again Zoe? You did, nice, good job. I also saw that you used the uh, the resub notification. Again, thank you, Mel, for all your generosity. And Zoe, welcome back for another month of being subbed. Amelia's lurking as well. Lurk party started. Lurk mode in Shake, 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 shake that hand. Stable, solid as a rock. Thanks for checking. Um, on to more hellos. Darwi's here as well. How you doing, Darwi? Pika Kath. Hello. Also lurking, joining the lurk party. Jen and Utah here. Hello. How you doing? It's good to see everybody. How's your week been? I hope all is well. I hope all is well with you as well, Faye. Um, well, I grew up in Utah, the state, not the dinosaur. <laughs> Bunny, you were the one that wanted to see if my hand was shaking. How's it going? Good to see you. Almost a year of being subbed. Nice, Zoe. That's crazy. Hello. Hello. How's everybody doing? How's your week so far? <gasps> There's nobody on Pleasant Craft. We're all alone. It's going good. Nice. Excellent. I have had a wonderful day. Got outside, did some gardening today. Well, gardening. I did some shoveling today. <laughs> I shuffled a lot of dirt. Basically turned all the dirt so that my sister-in-law could start planting her garden stuff. I didn't actually do any planting. <gasps> Why am I being trumpet failed? No! Why? <laughs> Nate the cowboy. Howdy. How's it going? How you doing? Oh, jeez. Thank you for that, broken boy. How's it going? Hello. Good to see you. Ah. Loud. Loud noises. I'm doing good, Nate. I'm doing good. Welcome everybody we are going to be working on this lovely monstrosity the moss farm which essentially already works we built this the first time around i didn't do the redstone uh i hadn't finished the redstone rather last time i got back on and finished the redstone i want to show you some stuff that i had done in here Yeehaw. sounds work yes they do hey thanks for the follow nate i appreciate that The trumpet fail was for the raid Monday. Oh, mm. yeah, that was a uh, that did not work. <laughs> she, Bonk. Amanda was live on my on my screen. Like everything looked like it was supposed to work, and then it didn't. <laughs> oh, anyway, uh, I get distracted by TikTok. Oh my goodness. Um, yeah. So this farm, pretty simple right but i've i've as usual taken a, a simple design and kind of made it a little bit more complex because i wanted to try and see if i could improve it a little bit so urban's here as well hey how's it going normally you only have the bone meal dispenser here and there's a solid block whoops i have fallen in there's a solid block here that you power i have a button there you can see the button button right and then you set up a timer on this and all the redstone goes off of that timers firing these pistons and then the pistons above so it crushes all of the grass and the things that might grow on top of the moss then it pushes in from all four sides to break the moss everything gets picked up by the hoppers and then gets sent into a simple filtration system here right so we're filtering out ooh, we're filtering out for hey there's viking hey we're filtering out for moss blocks, seeds, the carpet, the azalea trees, and the uh, regular little bushes, right? There aren't, is there anything else that comes out of these moss farms? It's just those five things, right? I'm trying to think, is there anything else that it ever produces? It wouldn't do anything else. Moss, yeah, the moss block I've already got. The moss block right there. And then moss carpet seeds over here and then the two different little trees 
Looking for a chill stream and I already know that this stream is totally chill. Nate, it is indeed, and welcome to it. We're glad to have you. So what I've done is because I don't really need seeds, right? I don't need seeds. Who needs seeds? <laughs> seeds. <laughs> so basically, I'm filtering them out, but instead of storing them, I'm sending them immediately into a composter. Composter is eventually going to turn them into bone meal. Bone meal is going to go through these hoppers into this bottom dispenser. It's actually a dropper, sorry, dropper vader. As soon as there's an item in the, this bottom dropper, powers this block, powers the piston, or rather powers the torch, which unpowers the piston, which pulls this observer into this observer and creates a quick little clock, tick a tick a tick a tick, which throws that bone meal up into here. Whoa. Hey, how's it going, Viking? Doing good. How about you? Hold on. Why is everything so quiet? Hold on. Speak I can hear me. you pretty well. Chat is is the is Vikings volume good? Vikings, speak. I think. Are you on a new microphone? Am I on a new microphone? No. I had to turn you up. Anyway, how you doing, Hoser? I'm not doing to distract too much. No, no, not too. I'm not distracted. I'm. I welcome it. How you doing? It's good to see you. Um, yeah, I am, I am. I am working on my own farms today. And oh yeah, I saw you working on a on a, a moss farm. I am indeed. So. Yes. Yeah. 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 Oh. What are you building? I'm going to work on some uh, sugarcane farms. I can add like no time sugarcane farms in no time, sugar and then cane. I'll also be working on. Um, we'll see. I have other ideas for possibly a honey bottle farm. Ooh. I kind of built the baby one, but I want to build like a bigger one because then yeah. I can have honey blocks, which are better for redstone and all that mm. stuff. So much agree, much agree. I want to get into that yes. as well. Yeah. So cool. right on. Well, I'm just actually like I took a, a simple design for a moss farm and now I'm expanding below so that the stuff gets composted and recycles back up into it. Ha! Hey, Penelope. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thanks for the follow. I appreciate that. Very cool. Yes, uh, everyone in my chat, go follow the big hoser. Oh, he's he is a big hi, he is a big hoser. <laughs> everybody. Oh yeah, here. I guess I should build a slime shop soon too, huh? Maybe I'll do that after I build a sugar cane. Are you uh, are you on uh, YouTube right now or Twitch? Twitch. Twitch. And TikTok. So, oh, right on dual the multi stream. <laughs> oh, fancy pants. Oh, Look yes, at him doing yes. it. He's killing it, huh? Also, I, I'm wearing you. my uh, farming outfit today. Oh, lovely. I love Time that you guys all have up. like 17 million varieties to your skins. You're all yeah, awesome. I, uh, I have three skins. I have the main one, the, the, the create mod skin, which is this one. And then okay. I have like a post-apocalyptic wanderer skin. Nice. So those three tend to cover pretty much everything pretty well. So I like it. I like it. I've just got the, the one, the big hoser, the permanent. Actually, not the true. One and only. I have changed it once in my entire like, hair. Minecraft. I added the gray on my 48th <laughs> birthday because I was like, it's time to own up to the fact that uh, I don't I don't look the same as I did uh, eight, ten years ago. <laughs> Fair enough. Fair enough. Uh, anyway. All right. You going to hang out for a bit or are you off to build um, your thing? I'm going to I'm going to really quickly. Yeah. Um, By the way, Penelope right came in from your stream nope. and followed, so thank you. Yes, I, I heard. Penelope. I heard. I heard you say thank you. Yeah. So thanks, Penelope, for doing that. Everybody My here pretty much already follows you. If you haven't, history. go follow so. Viking. You know that, right? He plays here on us uh, with us on Pleasant Craft, but also plays on Dominion with a whole bunch of other people that we know. So Lagundo that we've run into a couple of times. Um, Joe. Joe's on there, right? Our enjoy. Um, uh, what's oh my goodness, I'm blanking on names. Jamie Joan, jeez, I couldn't remember her name. Jamie Joan is on there. <laughs> Dominion's on a bit of a pause, so uh, we're, we're just chilling. I'm, I'm bouncing around between other projects, and Pleasant Craft is one of those. So, oh, Dominion's pause right now on a pause, yeah. Oh, I didn't know that. I forget everything I said. Erase, uh, rewind the VOD, uh, five thirty seconds, and don't, don't watch that part. So look at this cool farm that I'm doing. It's really cool, Viking. Changing topic. <laughs> What'd you say? Also, I got a I got a haircut. Yes, they're noticing I got a haircut. So did I. Nice. Haircut mm -hmm. gang. Haircut, haircut gang. gang. Yeah. So, Hoser, you're great. You're amazing. And uh, good luck with the, the the farm here. I'm gonna go work on my sugarcane farms, and then maybe I'll come I'll come bother you and. Uh, Absolutely. And 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 we'll maybe 
just put up a slime stand. We could build a, a slime stand and start selling slime. We need to make a shop. Yeah, we really do need yeah, to we talk do. about that at some point, dude. We built this <laughs> yes, thing yes, like in the do. first week. <laughs> first week of, of, of the server. We haven't built a shop for it yet. So anything. Um, oh my goodness. Yeah, right. yeah. We should probably do that, but we I'll should. leave you to it. All right, man. Thanks for dropping by. I'll see you later. Ciao. Goodbye. Uh, Vikings awesome. Yeah, we built a farm together. Like we built a slime farm pretty much the first week that we got onto the server we started like ah oh, let's do that it'd be great and then never did anything with it my good we just got a lot of slime that we needed and then just whoop that was it so yes uh, hello ariel how are you uh, i did get a haircut indeed <laughs> thank you for noticing nice little shit shit clean up it's pretty good looks great thank you very much emilia i appreciate that hoser looking extra handsome today with the new haircut thank you Faye. you're very kind nate also got a haircut Nate, me, Viking, it is haircut day. Being sit clean for the new job. Loser. Hey, uh, thank you for the bits. I am being told to sit up straight. I'm trying as much as I can. I'm on a sofa. I'm on a sofa. And if I move and I sit up, I move my microphone. Broken boy, leave me alone. Don't, 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 don't. <laughs> Just don't. I don't have an end to that sentence. Just don't. Thank you, Penelope. I appreciate that. Very generous. Um, yeah, so this, the, the beauty of this farm is, right, I'm composting this nonsense and it replenishes the farm and just loads it all back up into here. So basically we just need to put a timer on this block and like a simple etho clock somewhere here that doesn't interfere with anything else. Obviously that's the uh, kind of big trick there. Brownie Bits Gaming, how's it going? Been a minute indeed. How's things? I'm, I'm working on my, I'm working on a moss farm. Um, how's things? At least I'm comfy. I am indeed. It is comfy. I'll tell you that. It's a little bit hard not to just like mm, lay back, take a nap, comfortable sofa. I figure at some point I will have enough flowering azaleas and regular azaleas that I won't really need to like store anymore so what i probably should do i mean it'll it'll cost me a little uh in iron but if i bring that last hopper down and wrap right into oh, i'd have to come in front so i don't trip up these uh whoops i'm breaking stuff i don't mean to um go through there no they'd be locked because of those yeah so i'll bring it in front right a line of, of hoppers in front kind of thing and just drop it into here so that anything that goes, once these are all filled up, the overflow basically is all going to go back into the compost section. I'll drop it into that right there. And then it composts. A Minecraft sleep stream. That'd be awesome. Uh, I'm on vacation. It's not the normal setup. Yeah, there's that too. There's that too. I normally sit on a, a big orange ball and I'm like bouncing around, having a good time. Now I'm uh, very much not in my office. Check this out though, because when I go into chat cam mode, oh, we have a library now. Oh, it's very fancy. The very fancy big hoser in his library. Mm -hmm. And I have my uh, water bottle on display so that you can all see where I am. And, and this is chat mode now. But then we go back to this mode. Weep. Ta -da. <laughs> blah, blah. Um, Brownie Bits is going very well. Just got the new gaming PC set up nice and working on getting everything exactly how I want it. That's always a fun time. False bubbles. I know they are false bubbles, but, but, but I do have a can of actual bubbles, actual bubbles. So exciting. So exciting. Big Hoser's big library. Yeah. I like it. It's comfy. Okay. So how many hoppers would that cost me we need to go from there and then drop into <clears throat> no i don't want to feed that one because this one is locked until more seed comes in can you feed a composter from the side or only from the top like can i do that and have stuff go into it sally how's it going yes i got a vacation cut i was walking by a place and it was like hey Walk-ins accepted? I'll walk in. How you doing? <laughs> You've got the zero sugar ones? Uh, zero sugar is, the, is what I need nowadays. I'm reasonably diabetic, so it's, it's a new thing for me. <clears throat> ah. 
you do all. Urban, why am I being trumpet fail? Oh, composter side feeding is a no? Hmm. Well, I mean, not the end of the world. I um, will put another composter here and just run the anything that is there like straight into a separate composter. That will only do seeds and we'll do the other stuff over there. So I need a uh, composter, which I don't have, of course. Composter? No. Dude. Composter? No. Composter. No. Composter. No. What if I say it with more authority? Composter. Block of iron. I'm gonna need some iron. Composter. Ciao, Urban. Take care. Thanks for dropping by. We'll see you next time. Mm. All right, well, I'm gonna have to go make a composter. Barrels are pog, but could be better. How could they be better? Urban's really sleepy. Sleepy Urban, have a good night. Get some rest. Get some sleep. Sleepy, sleepy, sleep. Sleep. Okay, so I need both. Whoa. What are you guys doing? Just hanging out? I need uh, some chests to make some hoppers. I don't really have a lot. Oh, well, that'll probably do me, actually. I don't think of it. <clears throat> it would be so amazing if you could connect barrels to make. Oh, yeah, double barrel. Like, <laughs> like the shotgun. <laughs> double barrel. But no, I agree. I agree. Yes. Bigger barrels would also would be great. Agreed. I must agree. Uh, do I have enough scrap wood to just make one composter? Yes, I do. I make a composter out of you. Jabbity. Oh, I threw that right down the hole. Hmm. 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 What? Can I toss here? Stone. I can put a stack of stone back here. Oh. I'm gonna go salvage that little Go get the plank! We gotta save the plank! Ah! I got it. I got it. Don't worry, everybody. I got it. We saved the plank. Um I was wait, what'd you say? I was very lucky earlier. I was going back to my base from the main spawn. Teleport. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I have to stop so I can read this. Uh, I was going back to my base from the main spawn teleport where the battery in my mouse died. Oh. By the time you put the new battery in, still alive, no injuries. Nice. Oh, that's terrifying. <laughs> escape. Hit escape, go to the menu, and then like tap, 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 and spacebar. And, and if you do that, you, you might exit the game and not die. But if you mess it up, you're dead. GG's. GG's for not dying. Um, okay, composter. And barrels for hoppers. I mean, chests for hoppers, not barrels. Um, not what I was thinking. Uh, more like those massive barrels you see in breweries and stuff. Oh, like, like that. Just as many as you can connect, you could connect. <laughs> that would be a crazy barrel. <laughs> Always a little scary when the controller dies, but at least I have touchscreen. Yes, there's that. On the laptop, like, if worst case, I've got the touchpad and the, the keyboard, you know, there. So if anything happens, I can, like, emergency use stuff. 70 deaths, what's one more now? You're, you're not wrong. At this point, I mean, at this point, you might as well go for a record. Try and see how many you could get. How many deaths could you get? Challenge yourself. <laughs> uh, the worst is when I get a phone call while playing it locks my mining on and breaks it oh no <laughs> yeah go try to beat Emily that's like our main that's the benchmark for like you say you die a lot really compared to Emily do you die a lot oh it's this song this song just this goes. Yes, we are saying how much you, you, how awesome your death record is. 
people are like, I die a lot in Minecraft. Like, hmm. Compared to Emily? Emilia? <laughs> so when I say Emilia, by the way, for those who haven't noticed yet, whoops. Um, Emilia is Swedish. So though we say it Emily in English, it's pronounced Emilia in kind of Swedish with that little lilt, Emilia. So that's why I always say Emilia and not Emily. Whoa, excuse me, sir. Those of you wondering, like, why is Hoser always saying her name wrong? He's such a Hoser. Yeah, no, I'm saying it right. <laughs> uh, okay. Um, right. Hey, the MIG is here. Okay, so if we do this, that won't interfere with anything. It's not going to get locked by anything. And then essentially change that into a straight down. Uh, or do I take it out straight away so it doesn't get locked by any of that? Yeah. Bonk. Levi, how you doing? Top of the morning to you as well. What's new and exciting? Yoink. Um, I guess just go to there. Oh, torch. Come on now, torch. Uh, there. Hmm. Seems a little wasteful, but at least it all works out. I'll have to get composters in here to try and minimize the lag on top of these things. So I have to remember to make more composters at some point. Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. Bunny is lurking. Thanks for the lurk. I appreciate that. Have a good night's sleep. Get some rest. Ariel is on Java. No laptop, but it does have a touch screen. Oh. Mine is not. Actually, mine is not touch screen. I'm trying to think about that. I don't like the green screen. It's not so good as it was before. It was doing great before. Now all of a sudden it got like bad. I don't know what happened. Something changed. Uh, you're sore from head to lower back from chopping wood the past few days. Oh, but good workout. But also, yeah, that probably that hurts. Okay. Get a whole bunch of composters to minimize lag on this thing. But essentially runs down into there. Any overflow. Dump. So this this farm will never well, it should never break until this thing maybe fills up with bone meal and then this would back up and then all but I'll notice at that point. I would I would hope. By then I would notice. I hope. I would think. Um, Imperator, where are my redstone torches? There they are. Then the knit, and then this. And then piston. I don't have any regular pistons. Droppers. Uh, filter blocks. Okay, okay. Cool. Bunny's had a hell of a day. Sleep, bunny, sleep. You feel your arms already getting stronger? Flex. <laughs> Levi, I don't doubt it. Dude, I, I love physical activity. I was talking about it earlier. I was out helping my uh, sister-in-law. She's got a little garden in the front that she was getting to start, but she her back was sore. She's like, you can just turn the earth. I'll get in there and start planting and stuff. I went over, spent a couple hours just shoveling dirt. I felt great. I felt great. Feels good. Uh, am I still in hoser facts? I am still in hoser facts, yes. <laughs> hoser facts. Mm. Bubbles. I'm here until Saturday. And actually, 
I do have to let you know, um, I have to cancel Friday's stream. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, don't be mad. Don't be mad at me. I have to cancel Friday's stream because, um, am I drinking soda? Yeah, club soda. Club soda. Straight club soda. So it's just bubbly water. Beer, no, pff, I can't. Well, I mean, I could drink like a 0% or inject insulin and drink regular stuff, but beer's not really on my, my list anymore, sadly. Yeah, Friday, I have to cancel because, because um, I'm out here visiting two of my brothers who live out in this area. Brothers number four and five. And all of a sudden, brother number seven sent a message saying, hey, I'm in Halifax. I'm there for some work. I'm there for like nine days, blah, blah, blah. I arrive Wednesday. He arrives today, but late, late tonight. And he's going to be working tomorrow, but then he's free Friday. So we're all getting together, and his new girlfriend is flying in Friday, I think. Uh, he's flying her in to like, hang out in Halifax and meet all of us. And there's somebody else on the server. Elfie's here. Hey, hey, everybody's on today. Love it. Love it. Well, not everybody, but you know, lots of us. Um, so yeah, so he's here. And so we're going to have like a dinner thing on Friday with four of the brothers, maybe and all of the, you know, the stepwives and girlfriends and kids and stuff. So it's going to be a whole big thing. And I didn't want to be, I didn't want to be like, well, they're already on Friday. Unfortunately, it would be like, hey, guys, uh, like, so I really enjoyed having dinner with all of you. It's really wonderful to see all of you, but I have to go right now and stream in the basement. Please don't make too much noise. While you're... <laughs> like, it's just, it wouldn't be possible. So, yeah, so we're going to have to cancel on Friday. I'm very sorry. We're going to be hanging out with a big old family thing. They'll bring a date for me. Maybe they'll bring a date for me. It's not impossible. Well, highly unlikely, but not impossible. Not impossible. Okay, so look, we need to put a clock on this thing. And I'm thinking probably an etho clock that I would want to control with a lever. Randomly back to this. I'll catch up on chat. Give me a second here. Uh, oh, Bunny explained why what, what the, the day was. Uh, best friend and I had a fight about TikTok, and I got real mad, so I'm going to calm myself down and be back tomorrow, hopefully. Well, I, I'm sorry you had a fight, but chill, no worries. I appreciate you swinging by and saying hello. If you want to drop by later, if you feel you've zenned out a little bit, swing by. But also, yeah, get some sleep if you feel like you need to rest. Definitely rest up. I, I value sleep. So much, so much, especially as an old man now, like, oof. I did not respect sleep when I was younger. I did not. Two hours, get back to work, eh, no problem. Three days without sleep, ah, I'll, I'll make it, no problem. Ugh. No, no, now I value it, I treasure it. It's such an important part of life, it's so important. Anyway. <sighs> So yeah, back to that, Sally. Maybe they'll bring a date for me. Um, probably not. Plus, it'd be kind of weird. Like, hey, let's all go out to dinner and randomly bring a blind date for you. Be super awkward. Nowhere to run if it doesn't go well. Neither of us can leave. We're just like, hmm. <laughs> Idea for immediate temporary housing. Get a big shed. Add insulation. Sheetrock. Is that an idea for you or for me? Sally, you still do them? You're a maniac. You're a maniac. I gave up. I gave up. I love my sleep. There was an entire month where you only slept like 30 minutes a day, other Wednesday and Sunday. Broken boy. Yeah, I remember you did some kind of science thing at one point or something. Wasn't it like you were doing a... Weren't you doing that on purpose? Wasn't it some like thing you had... We were trying... No? You just weren't sleeping? Oh, yeesh. That's not good. Fun times indeed. No, not for me. Not for me. Okay, so hmm. let's just see it in action real quick. We have already five stacks pretty much. Hit this button once. Hit this button again. I want to see what it does. 
Whoops. We can kind of see it in action if you go here. Whoops. Kind of fell. But basically, it fires above there. Crush, push, up, up. So these all push down. Okay, the, this one fires, well, obviously the dispenser fires into the moss block. So the first thing that happens is obviously the bone meal boop, hits the moss block, which is in the center there. Then the pistons above push and compress bah, everything there. And then these pistons push and break all the moss. And then it all filters down, except for the ones that get caught on top of the moss block, which you can see there is some loss. But I hit that button, I don't know, like two, three times. There's already a half stack. I think I hit what? Two, four times now we've done this? It like, it's gonna fill up pretty quick. <laughs> like really quick. <laughs> so, I'm gonna be running it, but then it's gonna be producing so much extra that it's all gonna run into the composting systems. And then that's gonna be refilling the whole dispenser of bone meal. So I might be making more of a bone meal than a, a bone meal farm than a moss farm. <laughs> oh, Sally says I usually stay up all night watching scary movies. Oh my goodness. That's like the absolute opposite of, of me. And Bar Brogmoy just kept staying up watching VRCRP. I don't know what VRCRP is, but I'm sure it's awesome. <laughs> what we plan on doing if we get to move on to this plot of land. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I was talking about, uh, I saw uh, you post about that. Um, so what what happened to, are you still going to be buying the, the temporary one from the, your, somebody said, or rather you said somebody was going to be able to sell you a temporary one to kind of get you started? VR chat role play. Oh, I remember those days. I remember you talking about that all the time. So yeah, Levi. Um, absolutely. I mean, I'm going to be living in a tent. I fully intend to live in a tent four seasons until at least next spring when then I can start building the tiny house. And... I'm looking forward to it. It's going to be a crazy adventure. Don't get me wrong. It's going to be bonkers. I am fully intent on living in tent. Yes. Thank you very much. I'm here all night. Try the veal. It's great. Um, Ariel says, wow, I'm watching something on TV about food price in Nunavut. Insane. Delicio frozen pizza, $15.99. Ouch. That is intense. Beesh. Hey, VR, how's it going? <laughs> Broken boy. Yeah, so I'm going to be living in a in a four season big tent because I want to be able to like stand. I don't want to have to be, you know, cramped for five months. I want a nice, big, spacious tent. It's going to have uh, it's going to be four season. Um, there's this silicone sort of patch in the roof of one of the you know panels that has a silicone hole so that you can put a stove top through it. So I'll be able to have a tiny little mini wood stove in there. So I can burn one log will be like three days worth of, of heating. So um, yeah, it's gonna be cool. It's gonna be cool. I still have a lot of, of stuff to kind of think and plan about food preps, food storage, things like that. But I'm excited about the whole project. It's gonna be crazy. Um, ba -ba -bow. you got dinner, stir fry, and one egg roll. Nice. I had some uh, Thai food just yesterday for lunch. I had a cashew tofu thing, cashew tofu bowl, I guess, with some white rice and a spring roll as well. Two spring rolls. We had we had a deep fried spring roll, veggie, and a like, well, not deep fried spring roll. Like the soft one with the rice thing. Hoser off grid. Yes. A hundred percent. I'm trying. I'm trying to get a hundred percent off grid. That's the goal. So eventually I want to be getting enough solar panels to be charging battery packs to be able to run stuff like possibly run all of this stuff from the woods. Wouldn't that be hilarious? Um, because ideally I'll be building a tiny home 
that I would be able to stream from as well. So if I can run it from, you know, if I build a system that's strong enough to run all this out in the woods, I just put it on wheels and I technically could run enough power to do this on the road. Food source, so I don't share my food with the bears. Yes, uh, that is that is one of the issues I face. There's definitely animals on the land, not necessarily bears, I wouldn't think. Um, but I did see lots and lots of scat everywhere, so definitely have animals. Deer, I think, and rabbit. Or like wild hare kind of thing, you know. Something bunny, something like a bunny. Something of a bunny nature. Squirrel? Yes, there's probably squirrels. <laughs> uh, am I going to hunt and eat animals? No, I'm vegan. I could, but, or I mean, I probably would have to apply for a license or something. I don't know, but no, I'm vegan. I will, if I, if anything, I'll take a picture of them. <laughs> That's the only thing I'll do. Hunt and eat plants, yes. Although I don't even... Like, people were asking, you know, are you going to plant a garden and this and that. Initially, for the first, like, two to three years, I don't really see myself living necessarily there. I, I'm thinking more build the tiny house and go travel, go do stuff, you know? I'm shooting with my camera. I know, I will. Focus in. I'll focus in on them. Shoot them with my camera. Um, but, yeah, no, I, I, I kind of don't want to... I mean, pardon the pun with set down any roots when we're talking about gardening and stuff. <laughs> but you know what I mean? Like, I don't want to set down any permanent things because then I'm going to be gone for most of the year traveling around, going from place to place. Um, the garden would die. You know what I mean? Anything I plant would die. And I don't necessarily want to build anything because, yeah, because for the first couple of years, I don't really plan to live on the land. I plan to be living in a tiny house and traveling. So. But eventually, I'm absolutely going to have to get myself some gardens out there on that land. I've got so much fantastic topsoil. There's like four feet of loam everywhere. Moss, as far as you can see, every, it's just like such rich soil. It's crazy. Set down roots. I punned. <laughs> I made a funny... Um, oh, Darwi, I missed a big thing that you said. I have a fantasy of one day having one of those sunflower style solar panels that move with the sun and fold up with weather. Oh, uh, I think I've seen those. They look kind of crazy. Do they, do they, are they like efficient? Do they produce good, good power? Um, we do still plan on getting the RV2. Okay, cool. It has no leaks. The battery needs a jump, but there's still a lot of work needed on the interior. Not, to, I mean, if it's a starting point, Levi. Love the idea of getting the RV mostly because it allows us to move anywhere we need to go. True. Like maybe Halifax. Ha, <laughs> you're funny. <laughs> uh, when do you do that hee hee face? You look like Quagmire. When I do that hee hee face? <laughs> hee. Um... You know a thing or two about solar panels? Sally, I told you I was going to be picking your brain when I get going. I have to find a local supplier here that might be able to... What I'm hoping to do is talk with one of my brothers who has told me that he has connections in that industry as well. He works in... Uh, he's an engineer, works in installations and stuff, so he's definitely connected. And what I'm hoping he can do is find me some company that's got, like, extra leftover stock from a project or a company that's gone under that needs to liquidate everything and like go he'll have the ins on that kind of industry news that potentially i could get a good deal that's what i'm kind of hoping i don't want to make them from scratch no <laughs> they're supposed to be efficient but they are from seventeen thousand us dollars to twenty five thousand Ouch, Charlie, that's expensive. Woo, that's expensive. Um, hmm. Yeah, I don't know that I could do that. That would be beyond my means right now, I'll tell you. Because, I mean, unless it produces, like, just insane amounts of electricity, I would probably need more than one. So, okay. All right, so let's imagine, whoops, 
Let's imagine I didn't keep falling. Let's let's imagine I was good at the game. Everybody imagine that I was really, really good at this game. Just pretend with me for like a minute, okay? <laughs> um, we need to put a building in here. I think the floor could, the stairs could go like here. The floor could be right on here, I think. That would be acceptable. Hello, hello. How you can tell? How you can tell we're looking for you? You get to hear just your name a million times over and over and over. Nice. How goes it? It goes well, gentlemen. How goes it over here? I've just decided where the floor should be. I've finished a farm. You already did your sugar cane? Yeah, I built I built the sugar cane farm. It took. About as long as I thought it would. Yep. So it's pretty quick. If you've got everything you need for it, ba boom, done. Yeah. Poof. There it goes. Yeah. Um, I was curious if you wanted to go scouting for a location together for our slime farm, or if you were good with me just going and picking a spot. Uh, at the sh at the, the shop, shopping, shopping district. Farm. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. Let's go. I'm down. Okay. Uh, we'll go. We'll go. We'll go another portal. You're gonna start building Actually, it out. What's up, Meg? You coming with? What are you up to? Uh, yeah, I'm just I'm just here as a a willing um, observer. Uh, there just needs to be someone with a duck head here. So oh yes, okay. Kind of yes. that you role. can leave Filling now. Filling the duck quota. You got it. <laughs> Hold on, you can leave now. Oh, look at you! I've got mine somewhere. I feel bad. Mm. I don't <laughs> know what it is. This thing is a, this thing is attached to my brain at this point. Permanently, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, permanently attached to the brain. Uh, <laughs> I actually I play with as much armor as possible so i don't die but i like the idea of the duck i i, I if fun. i'm being if i'm being honest i stopped caring about death because i've just died so much <laughs> fair enough it's duck since elby has been wearing his duck since day one apparently that day one he got it all right yeah. to the shopping district yeah to the shopping district <laughs> Sorry about that. Put the shop. Oh, I guess we wait for hope. Yoink. There's always going to be loss. Wire lengths themselves. Oh, you guys are talking solar panels? Yes, armor is overrated. Armor is overrated. What are you talking about? Ooh, lots of new stuff. Right. I love it. Okay. Oh, so, uh, actually, Hoser. Yes. Before, before I, 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 I do. I, I have not seen you on the server in a while, and I have some something for you. Okay. Down this way, over at the Bastion Emporium. This music is very fitting. I have clown music going right now. Clown music. Oh, quite you. <laughs> All right. Here's so your good. half of the profits. Oh wow. Ooh. Oh wow. Fifty-four diamonds. Woo! Yo. Boy. Look at this. Yeah. That's impressive. Yeah. That's awesome. I was like, I was like, we started the shop and I, I kept on like thinking, man, I got to message you to like to let you know that you've got diamonds waiting for I you. would never have found them either. There's no way I would have known. That's awesome. Thank you. That's great. Woo. No. Look at us. Bastion Emporiums are good. This reminds me of season one. Yep. It's good. It's Except good. I've got the Bastion way more. Emporium. Yeah. It, yeah. Mig, Mig went like bonkers. Is the is the sorting system still like surviving, or do we need to uh, expand anything? Or uh, no, it's actually doing pretty good. Pretty right good. On. Right no on. No Easter eggs. Disappointed. Oh yeah, I never got in on the Easter egg hunt. Everybody went crazy it with was the Easter chaos. egg. You missed nothing. Well, I'm kidding. You missed a lot. Yeah, I'm suing lot. Ducky for, be, uh, be, for due to this. So do you want to non-legal reasons? I are you, did you and win? King make, did you end is, up winning? Uh, is winning? paying for my therapy. Ducky won. <laughs> Ducky won? Ducky won. Yep. Whoa. I also no robbed way. Mig blind, and then apparently I got robbed blind by Lee. So, yeah. Oh. It is what it yeah, is. Yeah, no. No, no, no. At, towards the end, too, I had a I had an egg basket at base John's, and I was trying to, like, not make it obvious that it was there because Domity found it, but he didn't realize that it was my egg basket. So he made a deal with Ducky to take all the eggs realize. from it. Oh yes, yeah, yeah. He didn't Air quote realize. that. Air no, quote that. He no, didn't here's the thing. There was realize. a miscommunication. He thought, uh, uh, I think T's egg basket was. Uh, was I found um, no egg baskets other than yours once. I didn't so, even find yeah. any. Yeah. 
Yeah, he thought T's egg basket was mine because I miscommunicated, and then he made a deal with Ducky, because the deal was that he could take some of my eggs if he finds it, but Fair he enough. took all of the eggs, and I was down to zero. <laughs> so I got triple-crossed at the end. <laughs> That's rough. You had, like, a crazy yeah. lead. Okay, so, Viking. Yes. Where Did you have any ideas about where you wanted to put it? No, I just wanted to wander around and look. Just wander? Because, yeah, like, Milkman's spots. put in a new spot over there. Uh, it's very open right around this area. Yeah. But also, there's the new area. If we run this way, right? There's a mm, oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We might want to start planning that out. That's that, that's definitely a place to, to work towards. To work on. Hmm. The site of the massacre. The massacre. We don't speak of it. I love this tunnel, which, yes, I realize still needs to have a hoser head put on it. I realize. Yeah. yeah. Very soon. Mm -hmm. Very soon. I know. I know. Very soon. We'll we'll do it. We'll do a thing at some point. Not today. Please put away everything. Please stop. Please stop. Not no, today. No, no. Not today. <laughs> not today. 372 <laughs> levels. Not today. Not today. <laughs> all right. All right. All right. Um, but yeah, we have this area over here, too. Like. This is a this is a viable option because eventually we're gonna expand this way. Now, hmm. I don't want to. I, I looking at this now. I think I prefer the area over there. Yeah, this seems a little too far right now. So right now it's too far. Uh, yeah, so. I don't think we're we're quite at this. Eventually, maybe, we will maybe above have to do this? a bunch of terraforming. Like what about oh, up here? On top of oh, this. Sleep. Good sleep. Oh, this is where the rails are this and everything. Is where the rail goes. So hmm. maybe not. We could do it. I mean, the rail is kind of a thing, so like you know, it's kind of yeah. What about like it, right? what about right here on this on this sort of mound here, like up here somewhere? Up here. Like we could terraform, kind of like terraform up and then open this path. This uh, oops, sorry, this bridge yeah, path. Yeah, put here. it right, right about here. Yeah, we could open this up and have a little shop right here, just selling slime. I could sell slime and honey out of this shop. I mean, you could you could put multiple shops along this area too. If you take it easy, Sally. Have a good night. Like thinking about, I didn't even think about this area. It's pretty open. Disc golfing with your brother. Stuff is, wow. Wanna... Sorry if I missed oh, a little this, bit of chat while I'm like, yammering with these two. But for, like, have a good time. The, the railway. That sounds cool. That yeah. So what do you think, Hoser? I think the two options are this one here. I'll put down a a pillar so we can yep. mark them. So this one here, right here, and then if we go this way. Like right around here maybe like i kind of want to say like this would be a larger shop so like if I we wanted to build a larger here. shop this is all my this is all my materials from the we could have this upper like... area here kind of this like, like this level so like we have a larger maybe a larger shop here or like a slightly smaller shop up there but maybe two shops up there i like i like both i'll be honest i like the idea of like filling that. in some of this outer space here getting you know like uh there's all there's this all this beach that's unused um, yeah we could also choose the beach like, there's that yeah any any of these so i would say I i'm know, good with slime and plus sand you know it kind of ruins the slime you know you put the get all that sand that sand gets all in your slime honestly and we should just gritty. we should just try to like decorate this beach with like just palm trees and 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 uh beach towels and umbrellas yeah. and tiki bars and, tiki bar yeah we'll make a tiki and, bar yeah Tiki bar. Well, I'm. I mean, if you like the idea of making a big shop, we can go here. If you have a big design in mind, but we are only I selling. I have no design in mind. I was gonna wing it. I was gonna go for my idea. The I had two ideas, right? Kind of like a mountain of slime, Jeez, like someone like bar. did like a, a booger on the ground, like a like a yeah. giant mountain of slime, right? Because we have a yeah. lot of it, so it kind of like stand out. Yeah. The other idea was a house type like a like a medieval inspired house but the roof is like a green with like the slime mixed in and, and green concrete and green concrete powder and it would be more like a slime shop factory you know okay so i'm like, good with so like, either i think an inspiration picture for that actually i could pull it up hold on um i believe it was mr matt ranger that dude's that dude's a builder Oh, yeah, yeah. I've seen Mel builds Matt Ranger stuff as well. So, uh, send it to me on Discord as well, if you don't mind. Yeah, you're showing I'm your chat, but I will see it. Um, yeah, one sec. Um, 
he posts so many things it's 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 nuts how often this guy this guy does does these things um he had a build that was very similar okay you only built one thing but <laughs> you put a sign up that, that said food <laughs> designed by matt it wasn't gonna be like a huge <laughs> right. like some of these houses he has are like super big but yeah. like um that's something i should do also is just practice building more because man i want to be a better builder <laughs> I don't know about you, but I, I want to be a much better builder than I am. Well, get on it. No, I, right. <laughs> I let me think... show. Let me show my chat, and I'll show you as well. And you can, you, you know what? Like you can move this path if you need a little bit more room, or, or even bring maybe bring the path here, like tighten in the path or something, and put your your build on the other side. Do whatever. I'm down with whatever you want to do, man. But I think like based on what you're you're saying with the the build that you want to do, this is probably the spot. The other one would be I mean, too you small. Could always also terraform here. I, I, like I said, I can yeah. move this this chest here, and there's this big open space in this area right next to the bone shop. To yep. Try and like get all the shop builds closer together. I've sent you one of the reference pictures. Okay. So. But yeah, I like whimsical, more of a whimsical vibe. You know what I mean? So, Discord. I'm looking. But I'm trying to think. Like, does that fit? Also, like, I kind of want it to sort of fit oh. in. Oh. Because another yeah, option yeah. two, an option three. Option one is giant booger. Option two is giant whimsical house, yep. basically. Yep. A shop, like a slime crafting shop where the, the people inside make the slime. Right. And option four would be some kind option three. I said three. <laughs> option, option 17. Three, option 23 would be we could do a storage crate, but it's a slime storage crate. Because there's a bunch. We just have the storage crates here, so. Mmm, I mean, you mean a shipping container in put one of you these, but it's a thinking, slime one? After but it's like a I, slime after, shipping container, yeah. Mm. I was thinking after I got like uh, all my villagers together, I was going to have like a bunch of extra food. I was thinking of opening a, opening a food crate, you know, like a, a food truck, but it's a crate. Ooh, I like that. Everybody's crate. doing crate That's things. Cool. Crate, 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 crate. This was, this one was T's, if I remember correctly. T's crate here. Uh, no, but this like, is Lee's. Oh, Lee. this is Lee's? Yeah. No, T's yeah. over there, yeah. So there's something like this, right? Where it's like the crate is open on the side, you walk in, and there's a shop, right? So if we had that, and just continue the idea oh of the, the, the crates. <laughs> now, this the is three great. options. The it's crate so one crate. would probably be the easiest one to actually build in like a single stream, whereas I would need to do some test work for the more advanced fantasy one, whereas the mountain one is like a blob. <laughs> yeah, the, the blob, the... the, the... <laughs> Plopping a whole bunch of slime down is pretty simple. Yeah. Um, we could also do like a volcano, like a slime cano. Jeez, you know? Louise, like, how many ideas are you coming up with? I haven't been able to build anything in a very long time, Hoser. Okay, I have ideas. We could also like, can off we the do coast, a shop? Yes, seventeen different plan ideas. I need ideas. people to vet my ideas because oh I haven't had a chance. Look, 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 look. Hey, I what if we also doing? We Thanks for do lurking. a volcano? made of slime you know you can like, replace like this little area right here the whole this yeah, whole mountain just take this mountain replace make, all of the sand with make like it a stone slime stuff mountain and make it a slime cano i mean i've already agreed to pretty much every idea you've thrown at me i will agree with this one as well i'm, not, I'm being raided oh on. no not the raid ah, what is going on hello hey, talk about it. Oh my talk goodness, about, Mr. Blue, what are you guys. doing? Hey. <laughs> I think higher than bigger here. Hello, hello, how you doing? Oh my goodness, I'm gonna need a second to catch up with all of you. Yeehaw. How's it going, Bloop? Thank you so much. Oh my goodness. Okay, let me let me catch up. Let me catch up. How everybody? How you doing? I'm the big hoser, just so you know. I'm from Montreal, Canada. I play Minecraft with uh with these Yahoos. I'm on Pleasant Craft this evening. Yeehaw. And we're discussing where we're going to be putting our slime a shop. But Vloop, Vloop, what were you doing? Um, Jabba Boop, Comedy Acorn. Thanks for the follow. I appreciate that. Broken Boy says build them all. Every single idea he listed. That's way too many ideas. I can hear you for too many ideas. Amy popped in with the raid. Fur Age did as well. The Living Carrot. Hello, JDMC. Jen, who's popped back in with the raid from Vloop. I love it. How's it going? How's it going? What were you doing? Vloop, I'm losing my microphone. Easy. I'm not at my house. I'm not in my studio. I'm traveling. I'm streaming while I'm on vacation in Halifax. So 
things are kind of not the same as they usually are. But it's good to see you all. North Rizenda, welcome back. Nate, yeah, do it. Focused Coder 13. Thank you for being here. I'm catching up. I'm slowly catching up. Thank you for doing the shout out, Broken Boy. I appreciate that. Everybody here in our community, I'm like nearly 100% certain you already follow Vloop. If you don't, do the thing. Do it right now. Do the thing. Do the thing. You know what to do. But yeah, how's things going? What were you working on? No problem, man. I heard you were traveling. I wasn't expecting the haircut. Yes, I also got the haircut. I wonder who rated Hoser. Yeah, that cleaned Big, up because I was. You can look who rated Hoser. I was. Uh, I was. Right, I was running by, or rather driving by, and I saw this place. It's called Fine Lines, and it said "Walk in, Mr. welcome." Luke. <laughs> They're saying hi to you. Oh, Mr. Vloop rated. Mr. Vloop's Vloop. sick. Hello. Good dude. Yeah, Viking says hello, clearly. I'm being helpful. <laughs> being helpful, very helpful. Uh, <gasps> you're truly being helpful. And then helpful. we could you use guys slime are... blocks to launch the player. Oh, my goodness. They're awesome. Anyway, Volcano. Luke, what were you working on? Meg, here's an idea I thought of. You guys. The ideas. Oh, hi. It's been, I know. I'm, I'm still saying hello. There's a lot of people, but I was hearing you and acknowledging you. Hi, Mr. Vloop. You. You're saying hi to Vloop. You guys are awesome. Yes. <laughs> All right, here's an idea, Hoser. Watching you bounce around while we're trying to Getting chat. Get the feedback, the feedback from you and now everyone else. Yeah, everybody so gets take, the vote. Let's go. What are we take doing? Take the two ideas. Take two of the ideas. The two that I love the most. Okay. The we, house and the volcano. Okay. Right? Get, we take this island. Yes. Turn this into a slime cano, right? Up here, at the very top. Yes. It looks like a volcano. If you look at hey, it from the thanks side, for the though, follow. Right? Over there. What? Yeah, it okay. Looks, Yes. It looks like a volcano with a flat spot. The house, like you put the house, like the slime factory, like the slime, like slime. I, I want to say slime workshop, but the slime workshop up on the hill. So it'd be like, like a slime cano with the hill next to it. Viking, take a with, breath. With the house next to it. Take a breath. <laughs> <laughs> take a breath. What are you talking Sorry, about? Sorry, I forgot. What's going I have on? to slow down. What's going I have on to here? Slow down for You're putting in a volcano at the top of this mountain. And the volcano so yeah, would, spills onto. The volcano is spilling off into the into the ocean. Into right? the ocean. So like to the left, the forward to the right, the forward and the left. Yes. This angle. Right, like, forward, this the left, the all sides. And then in the back, back here where Mig just slept. Yeah. Right. It's more level back here. Yes. Right? So, so this is where put, you're building the fantasy house. You could put a miniature version of the fantasy house right here. On the that volcano. That would be actual on the volcano and so it's like the lore of it is the people the workers who work in the house because like it's a workshop not a house the workshop are harvesting the slime from the volcano and processing it right here so these are some brave brave medieval individuals like building wizards. a house on a volcano because they slime have slime wizards slime wizards they're, they're like to live like slimy, slimy wizards, wizards. <laughs> I'm, let's do it let's do it okay Okay. Is the shop wait? Is the shop the volcano or the house, or like? Um, I think the stop yes. first step is to build first of the, all slime the wizards. Volcano and then Excellent. Get That's the, the name of the yeah, shop, by wizards. the way. That's the slime name of the wizards? shop, the slime wizards. We need a big sign. Okay, we are the hose that makes you and I the slime wizards. <laughs> we are the slime wizards. <laughs> the slime we are the slime wizards. Hoser and I are the slime wizards. Woot. Woot. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Slime wizards. Yeah. Um, I'm down yeah, with that. Okay. We put it up here. I think, yeah, we put we put it up here. We put the, we could also then, if we if we get creative, we could also put like a slime block launcher to launch players across to the island. Oh, I think that's a necessity. Yes. I think that's a I necessity. Think yeah. So, hey, Pod, I guess how's it the, going? The, the, plant, the, the things that have to happen. Good to see you. This has to be turned into a volcano. Yes, yeah, volcano there here. There has to be a house built here. And, um, we need to figure out where we're selling this stuff. Give me a sec. I have to say bye to Vloop. He's going to bed. Go, go say bye to Vloop. Vloop. Thank you for the raid. I appreciate you and everybody popping in with the raid. Everybody here, once again, you have to follow Vloop. It's kind of a necessity. You know, when we always talk about looking for good humans, focusing and trying to find those positive people out there and focusing and finding them and bringing them idea. into your life. Yeah, we may have, I think what would be best He's is one to of those. build on top Follow, of the sand. So not find him, the sand, but enjoy, the spread sand, more so positivity in the world. And Vloop, have like, a fantastic this area is night. Get as much help as it can get. Thank you again for here. the raid. 
Go get some food. It's gonna I, I, I Sleep. Would use, I would use Take care the, of yourself. This, All the good this things. Sand hill as Pulse like a guide, is but important. It is indeed. It is indeed. Thank oh, you yeah, again. You and later. thank you for the lurk. Look at that, champ. So going I guess off. We're gonna need going off with a lurk on top of that. That's awesome. Stone and cobblestone, then. Brownie bits, you're not wrong. Loop is Maybe awesome indeed. And then we're also Pod need loves to the disc golf. The actual disc house, golf. Which... Yes, Ali's off for some disc golf. I am very bad. But, It'd be amazing um, if you could color water. Ooh. I don't. I don't know how to do the build, so I want to learn to do the build. That's the thing. Like, I want to get better at building. So which part do you want to sure, start sure. with? I'm. I'm back with you here, the uh, Viking. Are I, you I wanting to practice build the, the house? Would be better. Oh, yeah. It'll so probably be the easiest. Yeah. So I don't volcano. think this is a finish in one night kind of project. I think this no. is a return to it and keep doing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, I think um, this is a. I mean, I'm not. I'm not actually jumping onto this right now. I, yeah, yeah, yeah. I I'm, will be jumping onto this. You're right going to be you doing go back this to right what now. you were doing. Though. I'm going to go back to my. I just farm. wanted to. Yeah, yeah. No, for sure. Um, I, I'm glad I'm we thinking did this. I'm just going to put stone on top of the sand, like basically kind of like coat the sand with yeah, stone, I, not cobblestone. But I got you. Well, but and 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 andesite and some gravel and i was thinking other stone things. cobblestone andesite and deep slate Ooh, okay deep slate. yep yep and the gradient would hey, go okay you doing cobblestone or to see deep slate cobblestone stone andesite yeah gravel. you can get a whole bunch of you know varietals and and go for some fairly darker stone blocks as well if we're doing a volcano right so yeah this is gonna be fun i dig it i dig it okay right. so um yeah you're gonna start putting rocks down. I guess I gotta go mine some rocks first. Go get though. some rocks. Yeah. I have rocks, rocks if you need rocks. I need a beacon, I think. I don't have. I can oh. buy one though. I can buy one though. There's a shop <laughs> for that. There's a shop for that. Yeah. I will need iron too. There's a shop for that. <laughs> There's a shop for that right there. Or maybe I'll want That's a gold my gold shop. Beacon. It's a great mm. shop. Go to the iron mm. shop. Do I want buy a gold Actually, beacon or an iron beacon? You need an either iron way, beacon. Of course you need an iron beacon. But wait, either way, Hoser mm. makes money off of it. It's true. Either way, I win. Oh. Go, go, go. <laughs> <laughs> go to the Bastion Emporium so I it's can, so, I can so, have so, the share. So of course, either, the market. Let's go. <laughs> so either Hoser gets the entire profits or, or he has we to share. share the profits. No, then let's share. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do gold. Do gold. It's better that way. Fair that enough. way we oh both God, win. Oh God, Grady, Grady! Ah, uh, you're being <laughs> no, raided. I'm getting raided. Your turn. <laughs> See you. Now, come on. No, no, no. We got it. Wait, wait. Hi, everybody. How you doing? Look. <laughs> come on, Viking. Viking, 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 Ah, uh, this is fun. This is too much fun. So Viking just got raided by Grady. Grady's another player that we met. We were playing with Grady on the uh, the zombie apocalypse thing. Oh, he's looking straight up. <laughs> Go into his camp. Oh, wait, nope, we have to look up. Oh, you're pushing him. He's off. doing the look up. Yeah, I don't want to push him off. Do we push him off? <laughs> oh, this is nonsense. This is like a this is Sparta right here. Look at this. It's a little tempting. It's a little tempting, not gonna lie. <laughs> oh, he was in 3D. Okay, he's in third person. Uh, not 3D, third person. Nice. Mel, Mel's, uh, Mel's sniping, VR Minecraft. checking the other stream VR as well. Minecraft. Love that it. Sounds, that sounds like a, a, an experience where it, where it ends in vomit. Oh, that, that was too good. That was good. <sighs> <laughs> Okay, I'm a, I'll set myself up to be punched off. Oh, no. Uh, no Jen, I hope you heard me say good night. Have a great night. Off, Gotta take care of real life something. Go for it. Oh, you're you just taking care of something. Hopefully, you'll be back then. Okay. Punch me off, Viking. Viking. Due to punching. Due to punching. Punching. Oh, I did. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to. I swear I didn't mean to. <laughs> I was pointing at you to say, punch him, punch him. And then I punched you. Wait, he flew away. Oh, how rude. He's going to the Warden Elytra Tower. <laughs> oh, is he going to launch himself? Oh, boy. All right. Well, I guess I'll go back to my, uh, my stuff now. <laughs> I'll let you run around with him and chase down his raid. I'm just waiting to see it happen. <laughs> Would you see him from here? Would it render? 
Yeah. Oh, there he goes. Yeah. There he goes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's off. You can apparently go pretty far with that thing. Look at him go. Yep. Whee. I'm, I can make it all the way to my base with it. Really? Except I don't wear full armor anymore, so I don't think it's safe for me to actually yep. use. There he is. That was cool. Monk on the uh, your base. Your base is amazing, Monk. Your builds are always awesome. Hmm. Sorry if I keep knocking my microphone, everybody. I'm trying not to. I do have it very close to my hand right now. Bell noises. Bye, what did I miss? I'll, 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 I'll let you have revenge for what I did like a couple minutes ago. You can Sparta uh, kick I'm him. On the, I'm on the oh, 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 geez. No, no, not with the sword. Jeez. <laughs> sword. You're taking it too far. Hey, ow. No. What are you doing? Get off the mountain. I this didn't my push you now. off at all. <laughs> but you didn't all... stop him. No, I, I didn't encourage him. <laughs> At least you I don't. Would, you know, you, you, I, maybe you I did a little bit. You tempted me. You I tempted okay. me. I totally did. I'm sorry. I totally did. Yeah. Yep. There we go. Anyway. All right. Well, hello everybody, <laughs> and goodbye everybody. Have a great time. I'm gonna Bye, let you guys build Have some fun. rocks. I'll see you later, guys. I'm gonna build some rocks. Yeah. Go do it. I'm gonna right. build some well, rocks. I, 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 I... All right. We're off. Let's head back to our area. Oh, I've just gone supersonic. Look at me. Flying like a true champ. Oh my goodness. Uh, hardly trespassing if I put my portal in the middle. Oh, check profits. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm supposed to check profits. Mel, thank you. Kano. What? Oh, those are just joining us. No. <laughs> that was silly for nothing. <gasps> nothing sold. Oh, oh, wow. Oh, wow. Wow. That was, uh, wait, shift click. Hello, Other shift click. Blocks and materials. Because I need that for stuff. Forehead. Hello. What do you want? How much is it now? Has the price gone down yet? No, it hasn't. Pain. Oh, people bought buckets as well? Wow. That's impressive. Why so expensive? Was I supposed to change this price? No, you weren't, but I wanted you to. Oh. You weren't supposed to. <laughs> there you go. I've paid you. You've robbed me. Highway robbery. Oh my goodness. I'll need the iron for other things later anyway, so. It's good to invest in the future. Awesome. Uh, Thank you. You're gonna drive me to build my own iron farm. <laughs> we need to build our slime me? shop and then we'll get you're... profits. I know, but you can... then I'm gonna give all those profits right to you. <laughs> no, only half. Only half. It's a very smart strategy that I have. <laughs> I'm gonna build the largest iron farm the server has ever seen. No, put you no. out of business. <laughs> so Don't rude. tempt me. So rude. Okay, see you later. We're talking 16 <laughs> modules. Oh we're talking a Jesus. shulker box like shadows of iron. Size. Let's do it. Ev like we're building, we're building a farm so large. Oh no! That you won't be able to see the other side of it. Uh, I'm, I have fear for the server. I fear Goodbye. for us. Goodbye. Uh, uh, right after he bought it, I should lower the price. <laughs> hey, pick. How's it going? Good to see you. That would be good, actually. Drop the price right now. Hey, listen. What? The? What? Two stacks and 13 diamonds? <laughs> like, I haven't checked this shop in a while, but holy cow, we we made some sales. Wow. 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 All right, so uh, wait, which one's the vault here? Um, boom, there it is. That's, uh, yeah, that's something. Question of the day, go pick, do it. Oh my Jeebus. Gotta tell you, that feels nice. That feels nice. That feels so nice. I like it a lot. I like it when I get diamonds. 
All right. Enough being weird. It's very happy about the diamonds. But yes, pick question of the day. Do it. Do it. Do it. Oh my goodness. I should probably restock this, but I think I think we're okay just for now. Uh, I'll I'll be back at some point and we can restock. But I really really do uh, need to get back to what we're supposed to be doing, which is a moss farm. I've done like zero. I think all I did was press the button a couple of times to show you how it works. So we need to put in we need to put in the hopper, um, the etho clock. We'll put in an etho clock. Set it like I don't know, probably a five item count. That's going to be where we're going to have to test to make sure that the item count is good. Because that changes whether you're playing sometimes redstone timings. Single player versus multiplayer. Can vary. Bow. Pick is definitely typing question of the day. You can always tell. There's this long, empty pause. And then, poof, paragraph drops. I know it's coming. Question of the day, inbound. Yoink. How are we doing on iron? I think we have a whole bunch. I haven't had the iron farm on for a while, but yeah, we're... We're fine. Okay. Um... Megan's joined the game again. for water? But it's four. Thank you very much, Monk, for the reminder. I will finish the actual bubbles, which are in this can of club soda. Thank you for the hydrate. Ariel shopped at the pick at pick shop. Excuse me. Excellent. Shopping district is cool. I like our shopping district, the, what, which is not the same one as this. For those who are not familiar, I play on two different servers. So I play on this server here with the Pleasant Craft people. Um, if you're curious, there's a whole bunch of Pleasant Craft folks. They're all content creators. So they're all Twitch streamers or YouTubers. Um, and I also play on the community server with all of the, you know, the Hoser Maniacs and everything. Part of the Banlish community. Uh, that one you can join. That one's like a, a community server. And I was talking about that spot, that shopping district is also, well, they're both cool, actually. The one that we have here on Pleasant Craft, very cool. And ours on Hosermania, also getting quite cool because it is getting tons of new shops all the time. Lots of new people joining. Uh, is the iron farm still producing with those two bozos walking around the island? <laughs> no, and it's off. Like, it's officially off. It's been off for a while. <laughs> but yeah, I, I would have to get rid of the bozos. Um... You were there before Hoser made it. Cool. <laughs> You're part of the OG. Part of the OG. Yeah, I was I was invited to play with Plug and Craft for season three. It's pretty cool. It's fun. He reached out to Tough Man for some swift sneak for Pod and I, and he joined for two days in a row. I know. Well, I'm also I'm streaming from his house. That also helps. I'm actually in Tough Man's house right now. And Mulch D. Mulch D's house, but Mulch is playing another game these days. He's he's not he's not on the Minecraft. But I'm at their house, yeah, with Bleacherama, who is uh their dad, my brother. So it does help to have Poser in the house, literally. <laughs> literally kind of makes them want to play it a little bit more. Um But yeah, also being because Toughman was also called out um on uh, Discord. Pick was like, ah, does anybody want to like do some PvP? And Tough Man was like, massive exclamation marks, like, what? <laughs> we everybody in Discord lab was like, lol, lol, yeah. You want a PvP, Tough Man will will take you down. And Pick was like, all right, let's go. And then it was like Butterberry just posting pictures. Hey, thanks for the follow. The OG Marksman 01. Welcome. How's it going? Butterberry was posting pictures, like screen captures of mean man was slain by tough man mean man was slain by tough man then mel mel took on tough man and died <laughs> tough man's pretty good at pvp he's uh spends a lot of time playing the pvp it was your first pvp ever mel really oh that's fun nice 
Hey, Marksman, how's it going? Thanks for the follow. I appreciate that. Is tough nub? No, tough tough man is not nub. Those are two separate people. You had the ads. Ah, I apologize with the 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 pre rolls. Can't do anything about those. But welcome. Nice to see you. It wasn't fair. You were on touch controls. They were on PC. True, true. But pick. I will say, even if you were on PC, I think it would take you a lot of practice to get to the point where you're as good as tough man. Uh, tough man spends a lot of time on PvP legacy, and that's like that's all he does. That's the game mode he does. Doesn't build. Doesn't make farms. Doesn't do anything. Just PvP. <laughs> you were not instant, so you're proud. You weren't insta kill. You lasted more than a second. Good job. Um, Monk wants me to remind them you haven't forgotten they broke the farms. <laughs> Nub was Nub is never going to forget, and we will never let them forget. Monk, that comes up on Discord like pretty frequently. I'll be honest. <laughs> Anytime anybody talks about breaking a farm or a farm that, you know, needs instructions or needs to be turned on or off. Yeah, that story comes up. <clears throat> mm. I should play Minecraft more, but I do not want to farm for another netherite pick. I mean, I could help you get a netherite pick on the server if that's what you're lacking. It's not a problem to help out broken boy if that's what's keeping you from playing on the server you would have that within a day with the amount of people that would help you get a new netherite pick oh pick has got the question of the day let's go uh you get to meet anybody you want only once but you have to cook for them and only get one chance so no messing up would you do it repost oh i missed it the first time sorry um yes i would because i'm pretty sure i could cook something that would be okay I'm pretty sure I could do it. Are you afraid of cooking for somebody, Pick? Is that where the question comes from? <laughs> These questions originate from Pick's anxieties. <laughs> oh! What? Get out of the fire, you dummy. It isn't just a netherite. It's all the enchants I had, and I just don't really feel like playing. Oh, well, there's that. If you don't feel like playing the game, then it's hard to kind of, like, get back into it. Um... But if you need a, if you just need the ultra pick, like that wouldn't be the hardest thing to get. I would even volunteer to help because I'm pretty sure I have the pick. I have the netherite actually. I'm, I'm fairly certain I do. Um, I don't have a lot of books though. Actually, I don't really have a lot of books for the enchantments. Pod's a great cook, no worries. Pod would do it for sure. I would also, I would also have whatever Pod cooks because yes, Pod is a good cook. I like that. Um, Monk just posted cooking today. If you need inspiration, yeah. If you're not following uh, Monk on Instagram and you like seeing the weekly food post, Monk puts that out. It's in our, uh, it's on Discord too in the food channel usually. You can follow him there. Uh, BB, the enchantments are super easy. I can max a pick in 15 minutes. Pod, boom, throwing down the challenge. Let's go. Boom, boom. I will get the pick, the netherite pick. Pod will have it enchanted in 15 minutes. We're throwing down. Pick would also do the question of the day. You would also do it. You would cook for somebody. Good job. Good job. Okay, back. We, we. Might have lost focus a little bit here, folks. Uh, <laughs> I feel like <laughs> oh, I'm a little bit off topic. We were supposed to be uh, finishing the moss farm today. So welcome to anybody who maybe has not seen uh, where we are. This is Hoser's Harbor. So this is my little mega base in the making, which is a series of like multiple buildings. So I'm doing this mostly for any raiders who might be lurking and wondering what's going on. Each of these builds is a little farm. So like this, well, little, this is actually like Pretty big build but it's this is the bamboo farm here got a cactus farm over on this side they're all everything is linked by this boardwalk which is eventually going to look mostly like this here although i am planning to change the lanterns i don't like these they're not bad but i want something different i want something more contrast not it's too much blending right 
So anyway, and this, this eventually will tie into a stone pier that's going to be out here with some big ships. Mast. Be good. So the, actually, you know what? It's starting to fill out. Not bad. We need to get a roof on top of the composting building up here. I'm debating what kind of roof I want to put up, but something there. And then we'll have to, we'll have a new build over here in this corner. I kind of dig it. It's starting to look like something. This has to change. We need to move this with that this is like starter starter area which will have to integrate these farms into this hillside but yeah i kind of dig that looking looking okay am i gonna build an armada no they'll be like i'm thinking two two ships top one larger one and um we had talked about the ship types monk you're gonna go sleep thanks for popping in bud and hanging out i appreciate it have a fantastic night. Mod abuse. <laughs> why, are you, why are you? You're not being abused. Um, I am not going to build an armada. I'll build like, I'm thinking two ships. One, maybe three masted. And maybe a smaller frigate two mast. Or maybe even just a one mast. Yeah, galleon and frigate probably. Something like that. And in the galleon, the bigger of the two is going to be all of the villager trades. So all of the villagers, which are currently sitting out in the water over there, they're going to be in the boat. And then the frigate, I'm not sure what I'll put in the frigate, but something. Anyway, so we're working on, I definitely need to put a roof on that. And now this. I need to kind of figure out a color palette and where I would want an on off switch as well. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Give me, give me a quick second here. Mulch, you're getting overexcited. <laughs> um, okay. I do not have a lot of oak. Plant some trees. Let's go plant some trees. Um... Both of those are three to four mast. Oh, a brigantine would be two mast. Okay, so I'll probably do a brigantine. Get out. What is going on? He made it again. What? Trofo go. Tro. How you doing? Man, thank you for the raid. Hey, everybody. How's it going? I'm the big hoser. How's it going? Nice to meet you. Welcome. Welcome. I'll try to catch up with everything. I've lost my mouse. Where's my mouse? There's it going. I'm traveling, everybody. So I'm the big loser. I'm from Montreal, Canada. If you haven't met me before, welcome. Nice to meet you. I play Minecraft. But I'm traveling this week. I'm at my brother's house out in Halifax. This is not my usual stream setup. I've got some kind of sketchy green screen. I've got some uh, nephew sounds in the background. Uh, it's it's an interesting travel stream. How are you all doing? Tro. What were you up to? Let me let me catch up with everything here. Minecraft Melly popping in with the raid. Thank you for being here. Rogue73 as well. By the way, everybody, you know what to do, right? Click on, click on, and follow. Click, click, follow. Click, 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 click the heart. Click it, click it, click it. Wolf Buttercup, my MC as well. How you doing? Nice to see you. Black Steel 53. Look at that. Oh, Black Steel is what? Gifting a sub. Ooh. Oh my goodness. Black Steel gifting to Shro Fosho. Thank you so much for the generosity. I appreciate that. That's awesome. Shro, now you're a sub. You can have all the syrup. All the syrup. It's all yours. Also, what were you up to? What'd you get up to? You're building, oh, there it is. You're building even more trees on the Dragonfell SMP. Nice. Ayo, thank you so much. That is very generous. I appreciate that. Well, thank you for the rate. Are you going to be hanging out? And no pressure. If you do need to go take off, you know, after a stream, get yourself some food or get yourself, uh, you know, some sleep. Or maybe just get away from the screens because I can, I can relate to the lights and the things after a while, you know, Yeehaw. take care of yourself. Stewman's Kitchen. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate that. But yeah, if you got a if you got a raid and run, by all means, take care of yourself. But if you're gonna hang out, hit the refresh button and just chill, lurk in the background. That's also very cool. I appreciate that. 
for those of you who are wondering, I, I'll do this again real quick because we were we were looking at this before you raided. This is this is Hoser's Harbor. I'm on the uh, Pleasant Craft SMP. Viking's the only one on right now, as well as us. Um, but there's a whole bunch of uh, content creators on here, so they're all Twitch streamers or YouTubers and stuff. And this is my little area of our big massive island. That milkman's over that way. Uh, Base John's old area that way. Anyway, down here in Hoser's Harbor. We have all these individual little builds starting to come together. They're all connected by a boardwalk. And we're going to keep expanding with every single building has to have a farm in it. It has to have a use for it, you know? Something useful. I don't want to have an empty build. So every build that we're putting in is a, is something. This is our bamboo farm. And yes, Emilia, I did get a haircut. Thank you for noticing. Pretty good. Give me a second. There we go. Sorry, I had to fix that. Um, I did get a new haircut. Thank you for noticing. It's very kind. My, I keep hitting my microphone. I'm sorry if I'm making sounds sometimes because like I'm sitting on a sofa. I'm not at my desk in my usual studio setup. Like I said, traveling. My follow goal surpassed eight followers. I try to go for five new followers every stream. Thank you for pointing it out, Mel. Eight followers in one stream. Let's go. Thank you, everybody, for being part of that. Good yeah. times. Huh. Ah, look at that. Nine. Bel Air coming in with, with the extra follow. I appreciate that. So we have our, our bamboo farm here. This is a cactus farm. Simple little build. And then um, we put in... This is a sh mm, sugar cane. This is a moss maker, which mm, you can see is not finished, right? We still have some work to do. Closing it up and then putting a roof on it. But before finishing it, I, I decided I should start something new. So now we're building a moss farm. We got to put a we got to put a build around it at some point. The fun thing, though, is. Hey, Belair, how's it going? Nice to meet you. The beauty of these builds is that they're all interconnected kind of below. So anything that overflows, right? So the storage fills up, boop, boop here. And then once this fills up, like I don't want to break the server, right? I don't want things to break. So I have it set so that anytime it overflows, it'll pop these circuits back here. Wait, I get to a better spot. Also, look, I build my redstone, but then I also make it so like it's an industrial area that you can come in and work, you know, the finished build all the way through everything, even the redstone. So this crazy contraption here <laughs> will basically register when those barrels are full. When these barrels are full here, okay, the hoppers up there get full. It unlocks a series of hoppers that start draining the system, not the storage. It doesn't drain the storage. It drains the other stuff back here, drops it into these water streams, and then the water streams go all the way over to that item elevator right there, which goes to the composter. So the composting farm will take the excess of any of these builds that we have. So this goes all the way back to the cactus one as well. Melissa Getzemeyer is here as well. Good to see you again. How's it going? What? I got to move, but the microphone's going to move. Careful. Ah. Sorry. <laughs> My goodness. Everything's falling. It's all falling down. Okay. Can you still hear me? Is it good? Sorry for any extra sounds. Right. So the excess when the cactus overflows as well, boop, drops it down, goes off into the composter. All of these builds are linked, which I truly enjoy. Makes it kind of crazy. You've been busy. Nice. All sounds are good. Thank you, Mel. Appreciate you confirming that. Plus, I like the idea of like logic systems that control overflow so you don't break things. The whole redstone thing, I dig it very much into the redstone farms. But I like building as well, you know, kind of a, an everything approach. Everything should kind of look as pretty as I can make it. Need to do more terraforming around here. And obviously the paths are going to be finished. We're going to be putting like a wizard tower in here, just by the way. Okay. A wizard tower. It's going to be awesome. 78 deaths, Ariel. Are you serious? 
That's awesome. Oh, you're a riot. Oh yeah, check out, for those of you who like redstone, if you're down with the redstone, check this out. I also wanted to build this for no particular reason. I was like, hey, could I put a bamboo farm like on a diagonal? Is that possible? Could I do that? And so I tried and it worked. Not too hard to do, it's great. I also didn't want to have the storage, like just bulk storage everywhere, chests, you know, as usual stuff. I wanted the storage in the walls. I was like, I could just tuck in some barrels here and somehow feed this into the barrels there. So let's go see how that happens, because it's pretty fun. <laughs> Come down here into the basement. I know, Broken Bar, I know you'll be excited about the wizard tower, I know. So again, we come down into our redstone system. Anytime it overflows, it brings it out and like sets off a series of overflow mechanisms so nothing ever breaks and it eventually spits it out into the water and stuff. But um, the hoppers collect everything and then send it into dropper vaders that are going straight up into the floor. So because of the timing of two observers looking at each other, when that piston pushes, these two observers face each other and you get a tick, 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 tick. So it will power the blocks above and below just enough times to take the items from below to all the way up into the barrels in the floor above. It's perfect timing. And then when it overflows, because inevitably it will, it unlocks, starts draining like the other one and sends everything into over to the uh, overflow system. So nothing ever breaks, which is great because uh, breaking farms and breaking servers is not cool. I don't want to be that person, you know? Uh, you broke your Elytra. You can repair them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can repair them. If you get mending on them, you need to get mending on your gear so you can repair stuff, Ariel. Ariel is very new to Minecraft. We need to help you get some mending stuff. Uh, wait a second, Mel. What? You can't connect because they updated this morning? Get out. To what, like 1.19.5? Is <laughs> really? Ugh. Why does it, why does Bedrock just do that? And you can't like downgrade. 1.19.8? What? They skipped all kinds of versions. Man, why y'all don't? Why would they do that? Why would they do that? Okay, let me make sure I didn't miss anything in chat here. Choo -choo 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 -choo. All sounds are good. 78. Wizard Tower. Happy Broken Boy. Yes. Oof. Can't connect. Bedrock is updated. Okay. Oh, that's unfortunate. All right. I'm going back to this. You broke the Elytra. You can repair them. You're on Bedrock 2. Amelia can still join. Wait. How can you... Amelia can, but you can't? Oh, maybe Amelia's didn't update automatically. I don't know how all that works. I'm not a Bedrock player. I've never been a Bedrock player. I'm not sure how that works. Okay, I was supposed to be planting trees at some point because I do need to get some simple oak wood to make some stairs. So let's do a little bit of that while we're here. You're on 1.19.73. Get what? Really? How do you even know these things? Amazon PC Bedrock, I guess. Yours updates automatically too? Uh, well, how does one update and the other one doesn't? Jen has both. I know apparently everybody, like, they've been saying, like, since you bought one, you own both, whatever. I've just never bothered playing the Bedrock one because I, I have Java, right? So. I don't know why I would want to start a, a bedrock game. Nothing against it, just why would I have a multiple games? Uh, someone will have to show me how to repair my tools too. My pick is about to break. You need to get mending. So you need to get a mending enchantment on it. And then you go to one of the farms. Well, I'll go to the ender under. That'll be the best place to do it. And you get your stuff repaired, yeah. Bedrock seems more jiggly visually. Jiggly? Jiggly, jiggly, jiggly Minecraft. Uh, you got a bunch of rockets from your shop. Oh my goodness, Pick's shop is going. 
Faye says, I have some extra mending books from Pod. You can have them. Look at that. Boom. Shaky like my hand. No, my shake. I'm not shaky. I'm super stable. Super stable. Um... Wait, what time is it? <laughs> I haven't been looking at the time at all. I've been paying attention to stream time. What time is it in Montreal right now, Mel? Am I on? Am I supposed to be doing half streams? I think I'm already over time. Am I? No, okay, I'm not. Okay, okay. It's 8.40 in Montreal? Okay. Yeah. So this clock, this one is on local time. I gotcha, 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 gotcha. Thanks, Mel. I appreciate that. Thank you for sorting me out. Whoop, hey, look at that. That already happened. Beautiful. Actually, considering I'm making a uh, bone meal pretty much farm, it's a moss farm, but it, yeah, pretty much a bone meal farm. I could just grab a whole bunch of like bone meal and get these trees growing faster. It would be smarter. It'd be so much smarter. Um, a little jab to me was they offered the two for one just after you bought both. Ah, oh, really? You had just bought them both, and then they said, oh, by the way, now you can, you own them. That's such a root. That's annoying. That's annoying. That's annoying. Whoop. Um. Uh, you made Ariel's tools. They have mending already. Oh, okay, cool. Look at that. You made the tools with mending included. What a champ. What a champ. I find that bedrock is really smooth. I see the difference in videos. Really? You notice the difference in the videos from like a bedrock video being smooth compared to a Java one being not smooth? Not smooth? You kind of want to have a new shop and you have two shops running. Do another one pick. Take over the market. What would you build? What kind of shop would you build? Like, what are you looking to sell next? Anyone who wants to drop me stuff, there's a small chest next to my teleport on my base. Regular chest, the blackish magic one is pods. The blackish magic one. <laughs> it's actually an ender chest, Ariel, which means that, well, no, you know what? I'll skip ender chest for now. That'll be that'll be a, a lesson for another day. I'll explain that to you some other time. Broken Boy still doesn't let you get bedrock, even though it says you own it, right? It says like we have both because we own the game. If you own one version, you own both, but you haven't been able to do it. Unfortunate. Whoa. That's a big old tree. Uh, yeah, that's a very big tree. Did I get all of them? Is there one tucked up in there? There's one tucked up in there. There's one over there. Beauty. There's one back here. Um, the magic one is the ender chest. Yeah, E chest referred to. I'll be next time you're on. We're such a helpful bunch. I love it. Jen says, I had Bedrock for a few months. My reason for playing changed and saw streamers using Java. So, of course, I got it. Oh, there you go. Just the timing of it is unfortunate. Ender, I have trouble remembering English and French words. You want me to remember Minecraft language? Yeah, exactly. I, that's why I said that would be a lesson for later. We didn't need to get into it right now. I, I said it. I was like, yeah, you know what? You don't need that in your life, right? Whoop, well, hello. This is not an efficient job, closer. You have failed miserably. Are there any more? I can't really see any other logs in there. Are there? Am I being blind? Hello? Hello? <clears throat> Broken boy, I, uh, uh, that might just be chat timing, but I got the two ones that, that were there, right? Floating tree. No, now it's starting. Now it's starting. I think it was just those last two that I hadn't seen. Um, 
and it's official. I'm addicted. I dreamed of the game. Ariel, let's go. <laughs> You're dreaming of it. Nice. Welcome. One of us. One of us. One of us. Emilia as well. <laughs> I love it. Maybe a raid shop to go up against Nub's raid shop. Yeah, because Nub's not on enough to like restock that. You could totally take over. Yes. Yes. I think that's a great idea. Do it. Do it, do it, do it, do it. Do it, do it, do it. Oh, also, you're you're both uh, doing the pick. You're, you're also building the post office with Jen, aren't you? Jen was sending me a message about that. I think that would be a great idea to have a building near spawn where we each have like a barrel as jen was des was describing it actually it's kind of like the they have on vloop server i think right or was it bruno's server i think it's vloop server or was it bruno i forget i might be crossing my stories but um the idea is we all have a barrel with our player head on it so we know who it is and it's like a mailbox if you want to drop stuff off for people it is Vloop Server. Okay, good memory. So some of you who are watching here from the raid, you'll know what we're talking about. Jenna suggested that we're going to have one like that on our server. And I said, yeah, that'd be a great idea. Not again, not this one here where I'm on right now on Pleasant Craft, but rather on the Hoser Mania server where the community plays. So pick, if you want to get in on that with Jen and do uh, a mailbox type build, we would need... We we're talking about how many mailboxes to build. So let's talk about that. Our server can handle 32 players at a time max, right? But that doesn't mean we're maxed out at 32 players. We could have 50 players and only <clears throat> only ever have 32 on at the same time. We could have a thousand players and only have 32 on at the same time. Ariel loves the post office idea. I think it'd be good. So yeah, like, do we do a hundred? <laughs> Broken Boy says hundred. I was thinking like, 50? How many players do we really have who are active? Like that number is growing all the time. Double chests and start at 50? Double chests. Wow. Wow. We're going big. Would you ever be bringing stuff to a mailbox and leaving a double chest of stuff? Just leave it a couple shulkers. Would you really be filling a double chest? Could we do barrels? I'm not arguing. We could do double chests. If people want that much space for stuff. Maybe make one for anybody who donates their head. That's the thing is there would have to be a player head probably. So some people who might not want to. Like I don't want to die. No. I will volunteer my player head for a mailbox. I have no problem with that. We'll do it. Barrels because barrels are pog. I agree. Also, no lag. There's less lag with barrels. Just a little bit. Just a little bit less lag, you know. But every little bit counts and helps. Uh, are we planning on using barrels so we can build around them? Yeah. You're planning on building. Oh, you're planning on using barrels so you can build around. Yes. Yeah. They already have a kind of a design in, in place as well. Single work and barrels would give it a fishing look. Yup. And Darwi says, come get my head. Let's go. Just go do it. Just go do it. Uh, all right. I need to make some plankadoodles. About that many. And just to get a sense of where it would be, we're going to, we're going to, Put in the area here but again i don't whoops i don't feel like i want this all to be oak so i'm gonna have to come back at some point and do a fair amount of like texturizing like i did over there when it changes a little bit of birch a little bit of the you know spruce and then the occasional jungle like just to make it a little bit less bleh, monotone but I wanna just get the shape of it so I can get a sense of where the redstone will need to be. Pretty pretty much all I care about right now is where the redstone switch could be. That's gonna determine where the etho clock goes. But man, I'm already like in the building if I put it there. That's, mm, that's a problem. 
<laughs> the door pretty much has to be here because if not, we're inside the building. Um, hmm. <laughs> Is this going to be one of those builds where I have to build the outside and then figure out where things go afterwards? It might have to be. Man. Or, or I move the path. I'm not sure I really want to move the path, actually. I'm not sure I want to move the path. What if the door is right off the edge of the path? Right here. Pow, pow. The door. Which would mean I would want... Yeah, I mean, I could build there, one there, one there. So if I were to put this here, that's just barely inside, but it's inside. So I could make that work. I could make that work. The door right here on these ones, you walk in, you're immediately kind of under it, which is a little bit, mm, I'll have to build, figure out some kind of ceiling that is better than this. Maybe. And then we go downstairs to get to the storage. Oh, that feels kind of janky. I'm not sure I like this. I might have to do some serious terraforming to get a better entrance. Are they going to rewatch a Netflix series? What are you going to watch, Melissa? Lol, you can get people's heads, Hoser. When I joined Vloop, it gave me 8 or 12. Some Vloop gave me some some of my own heads and one is used for the mailbox oh if i go into like um mod mode if i go into admin mode i could probably do that yeah there's like a give give player command kind of thing give player something something Is, is that's where I want a door to be so it would have to be here I'd have to build out like that Copperopolis how's it going step the floor down a block at the door on the inside so maybe instead of going up to a building I go down to a building is that what you mean oh hello Viking Psst. yes hello wanna buy some death sticks wanna buy some death sticks death sticks Get it. Do you have any, do you have any like, just like mass quantities of deep slate lying around? No. But, None. well, actually, uh, I have, probably have some. Back. Come, come um, look. Come look. Yeah, because yeah. I was able to get a shulker box of stone, a shulker box of andesite, a shulker box of cobblestone. Okay, I see. You have this normal, one. normal, de oh, there's the cobble. Okay. I want to, I'm thinking cobble might be better. What do you think? I have no idea what we're talking about. My thoughts are limited. Uh, thoughts are limited. Okay. <laughs> what are we talking about? Limited time, lam limited bandwidth, limited bandwidth. I Wait, forgot. We're talking about the the volcano. Volcano, yes. Um. So one, two, three. Right? Yeah. Let me just double up real quick. Yeah. And then the options are. Give me a sec. I'll catch up in chat in a second. This. And of course, this has the side texture too, so it's it's important to remember the side texture. Well, I mean, I would I'd be okay with using both of those. Why only one? A, a, a cup, I would use lean both? more towards the the whichever the lighter one is. I can't remember the difference. The normal deep slate. The normal deep slate, actually, because it's, it's got it. But occasional cobbled to kind of accent would be cool. Same thing with like cooking any any stone where you get some crack stuff if you want to put in cracks things. Crack stone brick. Okay, okay. That might be okay, but it, then again, it, it might not work because you're trying to make a natural rock terrain. I don't know. Yeah, I'll probably grab. I'll grab half of gravel. That then. I'll grab more normal deep slate than cobble. I'll fill the top two rows. Never mind. I'm gonna. I've stolen all of it. It's gone. It's, it's all gone. Down. Sorry. I have nothing. Um, you have no normal deep slate left. Oh yoinked. my! Get yoinked. Get yoinked <laughs> indeed, dude. All right. Back up. Back up. Back up. Back up. What? Wait. Oh. Okay. <laughs> You're pick up priority. You have zero trust. <laughs> 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 I would have given back your stupid shulker if I'd accidentally picked it up. 
with zero trust. <laughs> Plus, I have a full inventory. I actually would not have been able to pick it up. Not that you would know that, but that's because you have two stone in your inventory right now. I have too much junk. Do there's I have two, some stone two of yours? Stone blocks. There's two stone blocks in your inventory right now. Uh, there's 38 stone in my inventory, and you can have it. all of all right. it. You... I don't. I guess I don't need it. No, I'm it's right there. Take it. I don't want it. Blocks. I don't want it. It's been tainted with your two right. stone, uh, and I would never be able to tell which purified. one is mine. Purified. Ugh. Barf. All right. Okay. I now have, I think, all of the building materials needed to actually start building the volcano. Awesome. So, start the lining. I'm debating on the best way to like, like, start. <laughs> You well, I, I mean? thought you said you were just going to line the sand. Well, yeah, but, like, what blocks do I place how? Do I do a random pattern? Do I do, like, I don't I don't know the pattern I should follow. You know what I mean? Yeah, no, I get you. I tend to try to use one kind of main block as a starter and then patch in the other one. So, I, you know, go with stone, start dropping stone, and then stone, 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 and then switch it up, go andesite, andesite. 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 Got it. You know what I mean? And then gravel, 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 then back to stone, back to stone. Start spreading it around. If you, some people use like auto clickers to rotate through the blocks so that they get a forced randomization. I, I don't use the click wheel roller thingy. Um, I just yeah. kind of eyeball it. And if I look back and I see, ah, there's too much of one there, I just change it up a little bit. Elfie says start with the pure stone, then add a gradient from the bottom up. So like, place yeah. down the whole blank empty canvas and then replace the canvas? Mmm, you can do it that way. That's a, it's a little bit longer. Yeah. Tedious. Normally when I terraform, it's all on texture, so. <laughs> well, you, you kind of want to create... Elfie the, says yes. Yeah, using the, the, the blocks that get darker and darker to create sort of like crevice look is crevices you know you don't want to have yeah. like just random black spot at the top of a thing because it needs to feel like it has a, a natural Purpose. generation a to reason it for existence. exactly a reason for existence thank you a for the heads up mel for existence, yes. plus it's minecraft you build it you don't like it you change it it's why it's the best game ever it is it is all right i'm gonna go start so. Do it. I have faith. Bye. You're, wo you're wonderful. See ya. <laughs> How's it going, Amy? No you. See ya. You're no you. Wonderful. Look at him. No Look you. At him go. Look at him go. No you. <laughs> no you. <laughs> He's gonna do it again. He's gonna. There no he is. you. Yeah. There he is. I knew it. I knew it. <laughs> That's awesome. I knew he was gonna do it again. I could tell. I could tell. Oh my goodness. You play tabletop RPG again soon. You're excited? Nice. Excellent, Amy. Yeah, Mel, I, we're, we're coming up to the end of the stream. So for those who don't know, I usually stream from Monday to, uh, on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And I stream from 7 p.m. until 11 p.m. EST. So I'm in Montreal normally when I'm not traveling. And I stream for four hours. Usually take a uh, break halfway through around 9 p.m. But because I'm traveling and I'm visiting my family, my brother, sister-in-law, nephews and all that stuff, I still want to try and keep the stream schedule alive, but I am doing a slightly reduced hour. So, or rather duration. Melissa, I did see, I'm sorry, I was chatting with some people. You were watching uh, Virgin River on Netflix, I believe is what you said, right? I have not seen that. I've heard good things. I think that's the one that you said, Virgin Virgin River, right? Is it good? Uh, Copperopolis said, no, just on the inside, trying to preserve the outside, but give more headroom inside. Oh, back to the build idea. Wait, wait, well, okay. Put that in context with the build hoser so I know what you're talking about. Just on the inside, trying to preserve the outside, Give more headroom. So when you come up like here, step down into this level. Is that what you meant? Step down here. The reason why I have very little room to work with is because <laughs> the other build, this guy goes all the way under and is here. So as, although it doesn't look like it, um, all of these builds are really tightly like 
interwoven. Whoops, inter my mouse just fell. Oh, my mouse went for a dive. Did you see it? As it was sliding down. <laughs> Yeah, so all of these builds are like really, really on top of each other. Yours is good. You think I should watch it? Okay, I'll try to remember that for my recommended list. Half slabs might save you. True, I might be able to. Like I could get one there and then drop down maybe in. I'll check it out. I'll check it out. As it turns out, we spent so much time uh chatting and hanging out with viking and being raided and checking out what we're going to be doing at spawn that we didn't actually get as much of the uh build done as we were supposed to which for those of you who are new to the area of hoser mania uh it's also quite quite par for the course i do this a lot spend most of my time chatting <laughs> get not much done but have a great time doing nothing with all of you. This is pretty much par for the course, right? This is a classic closer chat stream. So a reminder, Friday, no stream Friday. I know that I say I stream Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and even though I'm on vacation and I'm trying to maintain the stream schedule at least so that I have my, you know, Monday, Wednesday, Friday, doing the two hours instead of four. But this Friday, this Friday I can't. This Friday I have, um, we have a dinner with a fourth brother who happens to also be in Halifax this week as of tonight. Girlfriend is in town. His girlfriend is in town. Him, three brothers, the, the wives, the kids. The, it's going to be a big thing. And I can't not go because I'm here streaming. That would be like they would all be upstairs. They would all be upstairs. And I'd be like, Shh, stop being so loud and having a good time without me. I'm streaming, so no, I, I, it's socially unacceptable, unfortunately. So, no stream Friday. And I am going home this weekend, going back on Saturday. Chatting with some, yeah, chill chat with some Minecraft in the back. Pretty much the description of my stream. That's, that's hanging out with Hoser. But I mean, like, things get built. We, we built things, you know. It also doesn't help that I play on two servers, so it's it's actually quite a challenge to try and like make progress on builds when I'm I'm all over the place. I need more Minecraft in my life. I need to play more Minecraft. <laughs> do you know what I'm feeling? That pain? Do you uh, do you have that 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 like need more Minecraft in your life? There needs to be more hours in the day so that I could put more Minecraft into the day. Melissa, have a great night. Thanks for being here. We're raiding as well. We're raiding right now. So let's see who's live because normally I don't think we get to raid uh, Viking Pilot. I'm pretty sure he's still, hang on. he's still he's still on, isn't he? Hang on. Yeah, he's still going. He's still going. We're raiding Viking Pilot. We're gonna raid. We're gonna raid Viking Pilot. Darwi, you're quite welcome. Thank you for hanging out. Let's go raid Viking. So this the raid message, everybody. The raid message is. The important part is this the hashtag sticky maple syrup raid and then throw in some like heart emotes or the syrup cans if you've got the subscription you want to throw in the cans of syrup and stuff like that go for it but the most important part is that sticky maple syrup raid thank you all for being here and yeah let's go quickly raid viking pilot uh if i could just get my mouse to behave here boom 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 where is he there he is let's go I'm gonna hit that button <clears throat> so I will not be back Friday. I will not see you Friday. Thank you everybody for being here. Vloop for the rate. Hang on. We got we got so many things that happened today. It was pretty intense. It was pretty intense. We had the raid from um from Shro for show as well. Vloop raided in. We got the gifted sub from Black Steel to Shro. We got follows from Stuman's Kitchen, Bel Air the the og marksman fur age focused coder saucy chat there's too many comedy acorn oh penelope skype cheering bits as well as the follow nate the cowboy zoe with the resub it's been intense today thank you all so much crazy support crazy and i believe we're almost ready here we go 39 people jumping in to go see viking pilot before i hit the button I will not be back Friday, reminder. So I'll see you all next Monday. We'll be back in Montreal in the regular studio. We'll have a fantastic evening. 
I no longer stream on Tuesday on Thursdays. Oh my goodness, you're all awesome. I will see you all very soon, wherever you are, whatever you're doing, and whomever you're doing. Ooh, blah, blah, blah. We're gonna try that again. Wherever you are, whatever you're doing, and whomever you're doing it with, or to, try. Just try to be a good human. We could all do that. What an amazing place this would be. I'll see you all Monday. Until then, let's have fun with Viking. Tell me it.